Hello YouTube. I want to make a sort of a response, maybe. Not really. Uh, my good buddy Greg Mollard decided to make a CD video and I decided to show a video of my music. This will have to be about three or four videos, about seven or eight minutes long because I have so many CDs. Timmy, come out hiding. You see, this is only a small fraction of what I have. Now, what should I point out first? Oh yes, a band that I got recently. Closer to home by Grand Funk Railroad. Now you can see why it's going to take about seven or eight minutes, right? I bought this at a local Birdland music store for about 13 bucks. <clears throat> Grand Funk, or known as the Red Album, probably the best album that Grand Funk Railroad made. Also bought this for 13 bucks. Grand Funk Railroad on time, a decent debut album from a legendary American band, and no, they're not European. Oh, 13 yeah. bucks. Oh, yeah, it's so awesome. Okay, now a band that I really, really, really love Deep Purple, Machine Head. Six bucks for the CD at Best Buy. Mich yep, very good. Even better deal, five ninety nine at uh, Barnes and Noble music section, Fireball by Deep Purple, the classic Mark II lineup. It's a very solid out after album. If you don't fucking stop doing shit, I'm gonna kick your ass. What did I do? And number one, the best album possibly in my whole entire music collection, Deep Purple and Rock. Look at it. I tried, it took me three months to find this CD in any store. I'm not going to buy anything offline because I don't know the condition. I finally saw this at Birdland Music and I bought this for 10 bucks. That was an epic steal for that kind of CD. Now I'm going to get you some of the newer music. You know how kids are listening to techno and screamo and all that nasty shit that really has no relevance to musical talent. Here's a band that y'all should really look into. This is Baby 81 by Black Rebel Motorcycle Club. Uh, didn't drop it. It's a very, very good album, and it was made in 2007. I cannot believe it was actually made in this century. Very, very good, and this will be considered classic rock to me one day. You can get this at Best Buy online, and it is one of the very few CDs, that, which I very hate getting online, but this was one of the few, I got this for twelve ninety five. Yeah. If you don't back the fuck off, I'm gonna beat the shit out of it. What did I do? Shut the fuck up. Black Rebel Motorcycle Howl is a very good classic album with acoustic guitars and stuff like that, and this was made in 2005. It's also an anomaly for the century. I bought this at actually Best Buy stores, this was sitting on the shelf, so I got it. Take them on your own and Black Rebel Motorcycles Club self-titled D Bud album. I bought these also offline, which is very rare for me to do. These are very, very good CDs and you should really cherish these because these are made in this century. This came out in two thousand one, this came out in two thousand three. They are not really that big of a band, but I'm trying to advertise them because they are very, very good and they wipe screamo shit and rap and everything else off the map. I will show you another hinder of my musical taste. That is classic rock punk stuff. This is the Black Angels. They are a psychedelic rock band from Austin, Texas. You should support them. I'm pretty sure a lot of you actually know these guys. This is their re most recent album, Directions to See a Ghost, and they're also coming out with a third album, I think, called Suffice Dream or something like that. I'm not sure. This is their limited edition Black Angel Exit EP that I bought offline also from Best Buy. It was very hard to get a hold of, but I was able to get a hold of it. Actually, no, I didn't buy it from Best Buy. I bought it from somewhere else. I can't remember. But they do not sell these anymore, and if you doubt the oh, shit, authenticity of it, there it is. It is very, very hard to get. I paid 20 bucks for that one CD. Another band I'm going to move into that is actually a decent major rock band, which just broke up. Audio Slave, Revelations, their most recent album. It is very good. 
also is Out of Exile. These are two very good albums. But by far my favorite is the Devo album. I bought this at an FYE. I bought this used for eight bucks at an FYE, and I bought this used seven bucks at an FYE. So it's not a bad deal when you know how to. And if you think I'm rich, then I just know how to spend my money. Another band I will move into, and this is moving into five minute range, and I'm gonna have to make four of these, but next week I'll make another one because I'm not gonna make them all. Um, this is Alice in Chains. I bought this at FYE in Chicago for about $12.95, and it's a decent album. Probably they're, I bought the Jar of Flies EP, which is pretty good also. And they're probably most prized and best out selling album, Dirt, which is a very good album. It includes Dim Bones, uh, Rooster, uh, Angry Chair, Wood, you know, other good songs, and Down in a Hole. It's a very, very good album. And they're Alice in Chains Legendary D Bud album featuring uh, Iron Man in the Box and stuff like that. That's not the only good song on the album, which most people think it is. I like the whole album, it's very good for something that's came out in the 90s. I like a lot of 90s music, and as you will figure out within the next two or three videos, because I have a lot of grunge. And finally, the kings of simplistic rock, ACDC. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Take a look at that. Yeah. I bought the most recent album, Black Ice, at Walmart which is very rare for me to buy something from Walmart. I try to avoid buying stuff. I bought this too. Yeah. Actually this isn't censored. Uh, Stiff Upper Lip, Ball Breaker, yeah, most The Razor's Walmart. Edge is great. Um, most of Walmart I bought this at Best Buy. Censored. Yeah. Bought this also. Bought this. Bought this. Yes I have 10 ACDC albums. Bought this. This is pro this is possibly the best one. Um, and bought their very first album, their D but <laughs> Well, that might be all, folks. Um, for now, I will make another video here shortly. So, peace, and I will show you part two.